Hello perfume lovers, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm having an unboxing for a fragrance that was uh, first uh, on the market, launched in 2013. And this is a fragrance I wanted for so long and I finally got my hands on it back in December when I was uh, sick with COVID in isolation, didn't have my sense of smell and taste, so I could not try it on and review it. And, I, and it's been about a month since I have it and it, it's still sealed. I resisted the temptation of opening it because I wanted to do a review on it. Uh, this is um, Calligraphy Rose by Aramis and what attracted me to it at first was the name. Calligraphy Rose sounds so musical in my head. Uh, and, uh, also, um, the notes are interesting, rose and incense between them. This, uh, this is very, very interesting. I love incense in fragrances and in this combination with flowers, I think it's going to be very seductive. Sorry, there is some cat hair floating around here. Uh, I don't know if, if you can see in the background, but there's a cat right over there, Fluffy, my assistant, who is licking himself. Sorry about that. Uh, I didn't intend to have a I don't know, movie like that, but that happens when you have cats around your house. Uh, joke aside, uh, I'm going... Oh, uh, by the way, uh, this is uh, very hard to find in Europe. Uh, very hard to, find, uh, hard to find also in the US. I could find it uh, on a website in Canada, but the transports here, it was very expensive, so I didn't buy, buy it from there also i found it somewhere in the uh, arabic world but also transports or the website didn't deliver to romania so i finally get my got my hands on it from a famous um, between perfume lovers in romania famous website it's called essenza deluxe www.essenzadelux.ro and the guy owning the website it's fantastic he can find fragrances that are long discontinued he has some great sources for them 100% original fragrances 100% legit 100% quality i recommend him to everyone uh so he uh, just uh, one night i thought well why not about why not ask uh, dumitru about uh, rose calligraphy uh, if he's able to find it and i asked him and he said yes of course i can find it and i was so happy and then um i placed an order for this one and for wood save the queen i talked about it uh, fragrance that I really really love. I uh, got to try Wood Save the Queen after the disease passed and after the systems, uh, symptoms went away and I had my smell back but Calligraphy Rose is still intact so I'm going to open it now live well registered to see how it smells and how it performs. Oh and uh, while I try to open it I will read, I will read you the notes listed. Top notes are saffron, oregano, and honeysuckle. I love honeysuckle. Middle notes are Turkish rose, myrrh, syntax, and lavender. And base notes are olibanum, laudanum, ambergris, and musk. All sweet notes. All of them are very, very sweet notes. I'm not actually a fan of lavenders or because I saw lavender listed in the middle notes. Uh, that was actually my problem with Alexandria too from Zershov and kept me for a long time uh, at a distance from this fragrance. I loved so much, so much uh, the smell of lavender. I used to own uh, shower gels, body sprays, uh, hand cream, body cream. Everything was with lavender at a certain time in my life. And I smelled it so much until I got sick. I cannot stand it anymore and I can feel it. Uh, in fragrances, even though it is in a small quantity, in a small concentration, I can still feel it and it bothers me, it makes me sick, it makes me nauseated. But I hope I won't feel it in this one, as I cannot feel it in Alexandria 2, and that's why I finally got Alexandria 2, I'm going to talk about it in another beautiful in another video. So, beautiful bottle, that was, I was about to say. And I love the color. The color is uh, cognac color. It's very, very nice uh, rose gem color. 
it doesn't look very expensive although it is not a I wouldn't say it's a cheap perfume, it is not an expensive perfume. Aramis is very famous for doing great perfumes. Uh, Aramis perfumes for men are very famous and are very well sold, uh, sell, uh, very appreciated on the market and between perfume lovers and perfume connoisseurs. So, the moment of truth. Let me spray this on. The reviews I read, the, vi uh, the videos I've seen about it, what my friends told me, the ones that they, own, uh, the girls that they own this, this fragrance uh, were only praise, praise. So let me see where to apply it so I could smell it better. Wow. Yes, really wow. Actually, one of my favorite fragrances, but um, three or four years ago, is Maison Lancôme's Rose Berberanza. And this one reminds me of Rose Berberanza. Great, great rose fragrance. Oh my god, I'm so in love with it. <laughs> it's a such a great surprise such a great surprise this fragrance so honeysuckle turkish rose mir ambergris musk and styrax this is the one this is the notes the, those are the notes i can fill it's a gemmy rose fragrance evolving very nice on the skin it's heavy it's overwhelming it's nauseating it's as an oriental fragrance should be it's very very sweet it smells like incense it smells like an indian cafe with uh, those uh, incense and with those uh, i don't know how you call them smelling uh, sticks that you burn it smells it smells like a church it's that heavy, overwhelming church smell, smoky, with incense, incense burning all over, with mirth, with styrax, and with roses all over the place, and honeysuckle, bouquets of roses, and bouquets of honeysuckle. This is the perfect winter fragrance. This is the perfect evening fragrance. It's an elegant fragrance. I see it with a long black dress velvety dress it's heavy it's heavy like a velvet rope it's so heavy oh my god i love it i really love this fragrance this is not an easy to wear fragrance not at all it's overwhelming you have to have a strong personality to wear this one this this one speaks for itself it's uh I don't know what to say about it. It's just that I love it. If you uh, if you know Maison Lancôme Rose Berberanza, you will love this one. It's as heavy as the as that one. Uh, if you love strong, incense fragrances, you will also love this one. If you love roses fragrances, this one is a must. If you love Oriental fragrances, also this one is a must. If you want a fragrance that will fill the room. And that will stay in the room after you leave. This is perfect. It's very strong. Very, very strong. The silage is good. I can feel it if I do that with my hand. If I move it all, if I move it around. And also, I'm sure it is very long lasting. I don't feel the oregano because I was looking at the top note, at the notes listed. I have my uh, iPad here. I'm not looking at my couch. I'm looking at my iPad. And I don't feel the oregano. The lavender I don't feel, but maybe that's because my brain keeps denying the smell of lavender to protect me. A bit of laudanum also, but very, very faint. The musk, the ambergris, yeah. The musk is very nice. It's not smoky. It's creamy. Oh my god, it's fantastic fragrance. I'm so happy I got this one. It's a very great, great fragrance. It evolves nice. It's not linear. It transforms on the skin. 
on my skin it really smells like a church which is nice because I don't go to church often so this one is a great replacement I paid about uh, 80 euros on it so it was a great deal I, I found it online at a bigger price but if you have the, uh, I saw it, by the way, I saw it uh, in the US at Marshalls at a very good price, but I could not order it because they didn't deliver to Romania. So if you have the chance to go to Marshalls in the US, buy this one. This is a very good fragrance. It's worth every penny. I'm loving it. Also the name, the name is fantastic. I, I often choose uh, fragrances by their name and calligraphy rose is fantastic. I don't think it doesn't inspire calligraphy in the sense of drawing with a pencil, but it inspires me the elegance of calligraphy uh, and also that talent hidden behind every one that is able to write calligraphy. So it becomes more creamier as the time passes this is very very nice let me put just another small spray on because i cannot get enough of it uh, and also it stays quite oily and nice on the skin yes uh, it's just a bit of alcohol in the beginning And then the rose, that jammy, creamy, heavy rose. Yes, a great, great fragrance, great choice for me. As I was saying earlier, if you love Oriental, if you love roses, if you love Rose Barberanza from Maison Lancome, if you love jammy fragrances, if you love Honeysuckle, then this is the perfect choice. Great, great choice if you can if you are a collector if you are a perfume lover get this one you have to have it in your collection thank you for watching me today if you like what you see here you can find me also on my uh, instagram account princessana.me on my facebook page uh, princessana.me and on my personal blog www.princessana.me if you enjoyed this video please subscribe if you have question, if you have observation, I'm glad to answer. See you next time. Bye.